Hey guys, welcome back to another Red Beard Outdoors episode. Today I'm back at the Waterfall Creek. I'm going to go up that way to uh, go to a spot that I found yesterday and try to get on some bass up there. Uh, there's so much more exploring up there that I wanted to do, but I ran out of daylight. So um, today I'm going to be bringing a whopper plopper just in case I don't know if I'll, how much I'll use that and then the rig I had on the other day is just a weighted hook with a little bit of worm on there uh, the creek killer is what I should call that setup right there it's a chance it might rain it's a lot colder today I got a raincoat and I'm wearing muck boots today instead of flip-flops and hopefully uh, we'll stay dry but I'm gonna hike up there uh, and I'm bringing all my stuff this time in case of another rod fiasco. So uh, stay tuned and let's see if we can catch a good size uh, creek bass. Here's the spot right here. Crystal clear today. I can see more because of the daylight. It's not as dark. I'm gonna have to be really careful not to spook the fish. That's why I'm talking kind of quiet. So uh, let's get going. See what I can catch. I didn't want this guy. It's a nice little one though. God, he chased that thing down. Jumped it. That bluegill gang, guys, I think I caught him the other day. Right in his same home. Pretty sure that's him. Huge bluegill. Back to his home. Let's see if that bass lives in the same spot. Don't want him. I don't want him. I'm trying to see if there's like anything in these big boulders in the water here. Something that might swim out from under it. That's a little guy. played those guys out too much. There's nothing under that rock like I was hoping. Oh, dead coyote. I was wondering what that smell was. Gross. 
Man, he stinks. Alright, I'm gonna move past him. He stinks bad. So I think I can walk out up here and there's a ledge. Just taking it nice and slow. Looking for something right now. About to the edge of my muck boots. Try not to let it go over. I'm so close. Oh, that went over. Gotta be wet now. Nice wet sock. That's some muddy stuff. <sighs> Rock gave away. That was nice. Switching to flip flops. It's super muddy. I'm gonna take my flip flops off. Oh, that's muddy. Digging my toes in so I don't slide. Oh, I just went balls deep. Oh my gosh. This is like quicksand. Things I do for fishing. Whew. Oh my gosh, guys, that was that was ridiculous. Bluegill. Oh, it's a big one. Get up here. Oh, it popped right out. Sorry, guys, got them all dirty. I'm gonna throw them over here. All his buddies were over there. What we got here? Big old sunfish. Big old bluegill. Golly, oh. God, these guys are huge. Look at that guy. Nice. 
nice size one. Sunfish. These bluegill big. Quick release on that guy, he uh, almost spined me. Alright, I haven't done it yet, but I'm going to throw this just a little bit. guys or just a little fish You know, now that I think about it, I know why those turkey vultures are swirling over by my GoPro camera. Because of that dead coyote. I saw them earlier when I walked in wondering what they were doing. Now it makes sense. Deer. Finally, it's been a hot minute. I'm going to make my way back over there to my uh, crate. 
Hey guys, ran out of GoPro battery back there. I'm gonna fish just a little longer back in the spot where I caught the bass in my last video. Well guys, the rain's here. A bass. It's a bass. Wish you were bigger. Buddy. Oh, I hear thunder too. It's time to get out of here. It's coming down a little bit harder now. Alright, just a couple more casts. It's time to get out of here. That was the third bluegill. Kidding me? Oh, are you serious? Oh, the bass guys. Oh, if the rain's making them bite now or what? I need to go. Oh, I didn't want to keep that guy anyways. All right. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. lightning there's the truck oh it's starting to rain pretty good should have left three minutes earlier Guys, I made it. I pushed the limits of that too long. Kind of hurried back to the truck here and lightning overhead right now and really loud thunder. Overall, pretty good day. Couldn't find that big bass like I did last trip, but uh, it was fun uh, going on that adventure and catching those giant bluegill. So, if you enjoyed that, give this a like and make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel and. I will see you guys on the next Redbeard Outdoors episode. Remember, get outdoors and keep fishing. Catch you guys later.